I need to meet with Master Yuan Shao and reach a peace. Young Han, handle this. Base forces are peasants. Nothing. Or none of them can match me. so badly in my duty. I may not have contributed much, but we are victorious! Report! Lord Ji Ling has been defeated. Our alliance with Yu and Shao is over. We can't expect any more aid? Then we surely can't expect to win, either. This place belongs to us! We will not give it up for anyone! them aside. Report! Lord Yuan Yin has been defeated! Jiang Ye has fallen to his forces. Oh. The enemy is coming with ever greater momentum. Strengthen the defenses in preparation for an invasion. How dare you raise your blades against me? I am your emperor. Someone slay these perfidious fools. This is our chance to push the enemy lines back. Follow me. Contributed much, but we are victorious. Yes, Excellent. your deeds will go down in legend. We are going to secure this. It is impossible, unthinkable, inconceivable. I am the emperor. How could I be forced to endure such an outrage? <laughs> You are still pathetic, even after calling yourself Emperor. You will never have what it takes to rule this land. My lord, Yuan Shao has defeated Gong Sun Zan in battle. I have conquered the Central Plains. And now Yuan Shao has control of Hebei. We may have no greater opportunity than the present. It seems the time for our inevitable showdown has finally arrived. Yes. Yuan Shao may outnumber us on paper, but I have faith in the superior talent of my men. We shall return to Xuchang. We must begin making preparations for this final battle.
Yuan Shu has been slain. Now we can turn our attention to Yuan Shao. Oh. <coughs> it seems like I don't have much time left. However, I just need to hang on for a little bit longer. That cough. I knew it. You're... Hey. What's with the scary look on your face? I'm just a little tired, that's all. Master Guo Jia. Ha! I guess you're a little too smart to fall for that line. Master Shunyo, your supposition is correct. However, I ask that you please keep this between us. My time here is limited. That is why I must see this through to the end. I would appreciate it if you could allow me to realize this one final wish. I understand. If that is your wish, Master Guo Jia. Thank you. I knew that I could count on you. Now, just as we planned, we'll slip the poison into his drink. Yes, that is the first step. Master Ma Tang and Master Liu Bei are ready to make their move as well. This is our chance to punish this traitor for seeking to bask in the Emperor's glory! I see you have shown your true colors at last, Dong Chen. Hmm. What is the meaning of this commotion? Father, may I have a moment? We have captured somebody who is part of a plot to have you assassinated. What? Dong Cheng? How dare you? Cao Cao, you are a servant of the Emperor, yet you ignore His Highness and act as if you rule the land yourself. You think... Perhaps you think you are the Emperor, or that you will take his place. You must be punished for your boundless arrogance. I have no intention of becoming Emperor. The land may require the Imperial Throne, but the Yellow Turbans and Dong Zhuo have shown that that alone is not enough. Therefore, I must bring a sense of reason to this land that, combined with the influence of the throne, will save this land. That is the path I choose to follow. I do not expect someone like you to understand. However, I cannot allow you to interfere, either. Take him away. Father, it appears that Liu Bei was also involved with Dong Cheng's plot. However, Liu Bei has already fled Xu Chong, and even gone so far as to abandon his lands in Xiao Pei. Hm. He truly is a small man, in both size and ambition. Cao Cao! See how they repay your kindness? If you leave them be, they will surely turn against you again in the future. You must eliminate them now, while we still can. No, we are fine to deal with them later. Liu Bei's only choice is to flee to Yuan Shao. There he will likely be used as a sacrificial pawn in a much larger game. We can deal with him when we face Yuan Shao. Even if he lives, there is nowhere for him to go. 
He will not be a problem for you any longer, Master Cao Cao. Hmm. Shahudun, Shun Yu, there is merit to what both of you are saying. Do I chase after Liu Bei, or do I make preparations to face Yuan Shao? I must give the matter some thought. Yuan Shao is using his superior numbers to his advantage. Our defensive lines along the Yellow River have fallen, as have Bai Ma and Ian Jin. That means that Pu Yang has been isolated. I am also hearing word that Sun Se has conquered Jian Dong and is planning to follow up on Yuan Shao's movements by invading Yan province. So. Should we withdraw for the time being and look to regroup our forces? No, it will not be easy for Sun Se to invade Yan province. He conquered Jiang Dong with alarming speed. As such, he has created many enemies. He will be too focused on his immediate surroundings to make a move now. Hmm. What do you think, Master Shun Yo? Care to share your wisdom on the matter? If we continue to focus on defense, we will never come out ahead in this battle. Therefore, I think we should target the enemy's positions at Bai Ma and Yan Jing. Bai Ma and Yan Jing are defended by Yang Liang and Wen Chao. Although, they are some of Yuan Shao's fiercest officers, their units are woefully undermanned. We should abandon Pu Yang and leave the bare minimum of troops to defend our main camp. The rest of our forces will strike the enemy and create a path to victory. I have made my decision. Shunyo, we will put our destiny in your hands. Reform the units and leave a minimal squad to defend the main camp at Guandu. Everybody else, I want you to rendezvous at Bai Ma and Yanjin. Secure the front lines and eliminate Yuan Shao. We can overcome our inferior numbers through intellect and bravery. Come, Cao Cao weaklings! Beyond the end of Yuan Shao's forces will crush you! We're going to defend this position with our lives, if that's what it takes. To come out alone. This ought to Impossible! Cao Cao's forces can't be doing this to us! Ah! Abandon Baima! I may not have contributed much! But we are victorious! Yajin will be your graveyard. What are you doing with those weapons? I'm stopping you right here. Archer, draw! Stop them, no matter the cost. 
Taken by Cao Cao's forces. What? Now Yang let them better him? Then we must fight harder for Yan Jin. I must challenge my limits! Excellent! We're advancing. Everyone follow my lead. Can't hold on any longer. They're breaking through. What did you just say? Yeah. Very well. I'll take care of this myself. We must stop the enemy here. Even at the cost of our lives. No choice. Yeah, we have to abandon Yan Jin. How powerless I feel. What about this? I may not have contributed much, but we are victorious. Report. Yuan Shao's man, Shu Yu. Wishes to surrender. He awaits word in Wu Chao. Welcome, welcome. Hey, get on in here. Come again! You have trusted my words and come to see me. The advantage lies with Master Cao Cao. I will surrender. I bring with me a gift. I will tell you the weakness in Yuan Shao's army. Here in Wu Chao, it's a large-scale storehouse. As you know, provisions are vital for any army. Were the storehouse to burn, for example, that would be a major blow. Forces are attacking. How do they know about this place? Do not let Cao Cao's army near the supply depot. Archer unit, prepare to fire. Hip. 
I may not have contributed much, but we are victorious! QA Gene, why do you have such a low self-esteem? You need to be more confident. A tremendous display of might. Now is the hour when we must settle this feud with Cao Cao. Our target is the enemy main camp in Guandu Castle. All forces, advance! What about it is time to begin the siege of Guandu Castle. This? Siege unit, show this land just how mighty we are! Those siege weapons will prove to be a major thorn in our side. We must destroy them before they can reach the castle walls. Zhao certainly knows how to struggle feebly on. Call in reinforcements and crush the enemy! Reporting! Reinforcements have arrived from the midpoint base. Excellent. This makes our formation more unshakable than ever. Come, warriors of the nobility! It is time to crush our enemy! What about it? The supply depot at Uchao is on fire! We need those supplies! What? Why would Cao Cao do such a thing to Uchao? Someone must have told him about the storehouses there! Such a large force needs supplies. Don't you think we might be in trouble? I must challenge my limits! That takes care of the necessary preparations. Now, we can move to the offensive. What about this? Our target has been determined. Capturing that area will deflate their morale. What about this? Our target is that parcel of land. Prepare to move! Our orders are to capture that strategic location. I want our formation to be in perfect order. We're going to join up with another force. We will join forces to take on the enemy. Preparations complete. Position. I'm relying on everyone to do their best here. What about this? We must advance our forces. Follow my lead. Our target has been determined. Capturing that area will deflate their morale. Let's go. The enemy does not stand a chance against our might. I bet there's food there. Okay, boys. 
Don't engage the enemy so quickly. Give me a chance to have some fun first. Preparations complete. We must capture that position. I'm relying on everyone to do their best here. What about this? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
After reviewing my strategy, I fight to bring glory to our forces. Preparations complete. You're doing really good. Great, even. My lord is disturbingly weak and has no future. I have a feeling I would be better off serving Master Cao Cao instead. Destroy 
the enemy. I won't let anyone thwart our advance. <laughs> Very skilled. It is an honor to fight alongside you. I must challenge my limits! You're doing really good! Great even! We cannot afford to lose this position! I shall personally see to its defense! to see where it leads. Long live Lord Cao Cao! Lord Cao Cao, hooray! This victory alone is not enough to end the chaos. We must seek out and punish all who oppose us.
Easy, Eugene. We have defeated our greatest enemy in Yuan Shao. Allow the men to rest and celebrate for at least a day. Yes, my lord. As you command. Mm. Everybody, listen up. We have defeated Yuan Shao to become the single largest force in the land. We are ready to begin our quest to unite the land. However, the fight to come will be nothing like we've ever seen before. Hard and fraught with peril. However, that is of no concern to us now. Tonight, we will celebrate our victory in order to refresh both our minds and bodies. Just you wait, Yuan Shao. The path I have laid. The battles yet to come. I will utilize them to bring an end to the chaos with my own hands and create a new world order for all to enjoy. Master Shen Yu, your work at Guandu was spectacular. Your exploitation of Yu and Chao's weakness in that battle was exceptional. No. My humble contribution was nothing compared to your own Master Guojia. At Guandu, it just so happened that I was the one the enemy leaked that information to. After that, I just used the information to give our Lord the very best plan I could think of. You don't allow yourself enough credit, but I guess I should have expected that of you. I, standing in front of people and detailing a battle is just not me. I have no problems with just acting, though. I just can't be like you or Master Yu. Or be like Master Jia Xu. Hey! Huh. Oh yeah. I hear someone saying my name and it turns out to be you, Master Shun Wu. It looks like you talk a lot when you drink. Master Jia Xu? <laughs> Sorry for butting in. I guess I can go do my thing somewhere else. Uh. Hmm. A small interruption. A great plan. Your ability to startle people is truly exceptional. Uh, I can't hold a torch to Master Joshu. That does put me in a difficult position. I had planned to have you take over for me one day. Master Gojia. No, it's nothing. You have your own strengths. Especially when it comes to... Anyway. I really like that you accompany me when I'm drinking. I couldn't ask for a better friend than you. Yes. I will stay with you as long as you need me. 